Good morning, gang. I'm, it's, what time is it, Donnie? <laughs> so today's gonna be a fun day, guys. Um, first, Donnie's here. Obviously. We are gonna be doing B6 gang gang things today. We got that one, that one, and his new one. You guys remember the S4? We've talked about it a couple times. You wanna, mm -hmm. you wanna sh show them? a full blown drift car. Seen a B6 drift car before? I haven't. <laughs> so this one's gonna be a 4.2 liter V8 car. Probably be blown. Yeah. Hopefully we're gonna get the idea is to get one of those Tweetler performance blower kits on here. You know, look really sick, make whirly boy noises. We actually had the boys from Tweetler on. We had Reed from Tweetler on our podcast over on Real Talk Vlogs. You guys can put the link in the description below for that exact podcast. It was a great time having him on. Uh I didn't hit the record button. All right, I'm an idiot. <laughs> didn't hit the record button. So earlier, I just realized while sitting at the light that earlier today when I was talking to you guys, I didn't finish my thought and we were talking about Donnie's car and then I got sidetracked because ADHD and adults and the long and the short here, my boy Josh, who oh, I, he lets me use his shop all the time, is finally saying, hey, I need to call in one of those favors. So we're making a road trip to Union. Now, oh, now that I've said the thing twi three times, we got it on camera finally. Oh. oh, he says he's on his way here. He's not here yet. He's got some junk. Mm -hmm. He has got some junk. All right, so that's the plan. We're gonna see if we can make a 45 minute drive. So it's 45 minutes from here to there. I wanna see if we can do the whole thing in 45 minutes. That's not gonna happen. No, the math doesn't add up. Even if I maintain no, the um, speed. I can say this right now on the highway going to Union, there's Stady Boys have set up shop down there. Oh, no, 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 no. We are not going. We are oh, going. you're taking back roads? Yo! What other way are you gonna go? Hey, I don't know. That is the most, I drive straight, I drive shortest route, and shortest route and fastest time are not the same by no means. By no means whatsoever. <laughs> and shortest route is usually a very straight line. Cool. Guy's shop that's calling in the favor. So always got something cool in here. Today he's got a GTO, which this thing is freaking sick. It's too dark in here for them to see shit. But then he's also got this thing. So Josh, uh, Josh shop is uh, JTK Performance. Pop a link in the description below. I'm pretty sure he only has a Facebook. So, but he also does a lot of side by side things. So, you know, he's just one of the boys hustles, repairs old junk, and makes it better. You can read his number backwards. There it is. All right, we're here. It looks like Josh is getting himself a Dirty Max. Big old crew cab. One of these days, I'm gonna buy one of those in a one-ton dually crew cab to tow my race car trailer with. Or bigger. I want a Cummins. A Cummins? To, to, to tow mine with. Yeah. I want something big. Like, I need, I want something that can hold a fifth wheel. Like, a two-car enclosed trailer. Mm-hmm. You know. What would you guys suggest? Let me know in the comments section below. Dream trucks, let's talk about them. Let's talk about it. And if you already have your dream truck, jump over to the community tab and post a picture of it. I'm kind of curious my what y'all's got. My dream truck would be a Suburban with a 12 valve. See, that's a half ton. Huh? No, well, no, they no, make I'm that not, three I'm talking about the 2500 Suburban. Oh, those three quarter ton? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But you're still limited to bumper pull at that point. So, I, I, I don't know. It's a lot to Just consider. Turn it into an avalanche at that point. <laughs> I'm done with this segment on this note. <laughs> we'll check back in with you on the drive home. It's starting to look like something. We might get this thing fired up today. Paul, what? you say it's gonna start today? <laughs> Come on, give it to me. I want to hear it. <laughs> it should. All right. Nice. It's looking good. You cleaned everything up well. 
Is that the carburetor? Is this the carburetor you're running? Yeah. No, that's the old one. Oh, that's oh, right. Okay, okay. This is the one that was on it. But that was all gum. Yeah. That's the throttle cable, by the way. Oh, okay. But but see the reason why I can't use oh, it. Look at that. It, it, it's perfect. When I pulled the air cleaner off, it, it had water all the way up to here. And every cylinder that had an open valve was full of water. When I pulled plugs, water just poured out. It was bad. It was and really what, bad. What, uh, we broke the engine loose. Bad. The way we got this thing loose. Oh, yeah, yeah, you told me. Yeah, we used the big pry bar over here to rotate the motor over with the clutch engaged because, in it. Uh, it wouldn't come loose. Put, putting a, a, a big long bar on, on the crank, it just kept turning the bolt. Yeah, it tried to snap the bolt right out of it. So. All right. You ready to get your stuff done? Yeah, All right, let's do it. All right, so the game plan here is with his car, since we're back from Union, we're losing light. He's got to go to a birthday party. It's party based, bus. huh? Party bus. Party bus. We're going to move this car, move his car over to here, get some jack stands under it, and get it ready for us to, well, we're going to prep it to take the motor out. How much of that process we get done? Today's day one. We're gonna say today's day one. Day one, B6 rear wheel drive things. Should we do one of these? I'm excited. One of what? These? Oh, yeah. One, two, three, yeah. go! All right. All right, let's do this. Oh no, we're gonna fucking send the power. We're just gonna send the power steering. But AC, coolant, transmission is over here. Yeah. As long as they're not, yeah, they're tightened back together. So transmission is routed back together. Those lines are power steering. I think we're okay to move it. We can drive it. Here, start it up. It's gonna make an awful sound. See, it wasn't so bad. It didn't get, it's not any worse. I think I'm gonna steal these rims off of this and put them on mine and take those and put them on this for the winter well until this is going and then i'll take the wheels and put them back on that all right you better hurry jordan no and, not right now no jordan and i were just talking about stealing these and putting them on his s4 for a little bit <laughs> i was just gonna put a set of so i was gonna put a set of 17 inch avises on it and be like yo he'll never know <laughs> I mean, if he wants to use them, he can use them. Okay. He wanted to try them. He wanted to see if. So when you put, so if you have a B5 or a C5 and you've got 17s on it, you swap a set of 18-inch Avis wheels onto it, and the car feels light and kind of floaty, at least on my C5. And Jordan and I were very interested to know if doing the same thing to a B5 would make it drive similar. So that's a humorous line between there. Anyway. You are okay with us doing that? Definitely. Oh, sweet. Jordan, you got him on camera just saying it's okay now. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> We're not far enough along in life for me to do one of these and edit it and it be out, so. Next weekend. Yeah. It'll be a full, next weekend will be a full video. Full video? It'll be a full video. Yes. And we shouldn't have enough line. I'll be out here early in the morning. Next weekend? Yeah. No, we won't. Oh, no, we won't. We won't be here next weekend. <laughs> yeah, so next weekend, guys, we will be at the PRI show in Indianapolis. So if you're around the area, say hi. That car will be out there. Jordan is talking about driving the B5 out. There's a possibility I might bring the C5. It depends on legality issues, if I want to drive it that far or not. If I'm not in that, I'll be in that. So... We're doing gang gang things. You guys want to do some roll racing? Hit us up. I know Mexico is kind of a f little bit more than a puddle jump away, but yeah, we'll make arrangements. He asked me where do I want to start. Um, Let's get a box. What do you need a box for? Start putting stuff in. I don't need a box. We only need a box and bags for this portion when we open this. Everything else is, is like Legos. It only goes one place. Let's start with all the coolant bits. Let's start with the intake bits. Let's start with all the accessories on the outside that bolt to it. We'll go from there. Because by that time, it'll probably that'll take us at least probably 30, 45 minutes. Yeah. All right. Let's all right. Dum, 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 dum. I think this one came off of the 454. Look at that. Oh, yeah. No, uh, that means we're gonna start real soon. All right, so the engines are disassembled from the car. 
all the coolant all those things we already had the front end off so it's pretty easy this is technically like step two only thing we really got left at this point is axles exhaust drive shafts and the shit on the interior and that's it and it's ready to come out so like maybe like an hour and a half two hours before it can come out yeah i'd say that's a pretty safe bet so like again not this week two weeks we're gonna see the that's too long if i really wanted to i could just drive out here after work and fill around with it and try and get the motor out but that's i don't get out here till after dark we'll figure it out yeah we'll figure it out we'll figure it out guys Ooh. Same though. is that that good good 93 yeah that's not the good 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 we're getting 20. close we're getting closer here we go oops oh we got power. All right. Go for it. Oh. Wow. It's going to catch. It's trying. It's trying. Hey. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I see it right there. Why would it do that? Something stopped up. The uh, flow is stopped up. Gotcha. It's not allowing fuel into the carburetor. Sounds like we need another carburetor. Oh, no, he's there. Just rebuild it. I think I'm gonna find a different carburetor. All right, hang on a second. We got to do one sketchy thing before you leave. What? Oh, that thing's not. Uh, hold this wire. I'm gonna hold this wire, and we're gonna try to roll up the windows on the car without burning the car down. Oh, there we go. There we go. All right, dude. So, all right. Till sometime next week. I'm gonna try and get out here soon enough, but that all depends on your schedule because you do have a family too. So. I do, but you know, as long as we put it in the books, we can get make it work. All right, we'll figure it out. All right, later, dude. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing to Donnie. Deuces. Later, guys. See you tomorrow.